the person I experienced was, a, was deeply ambivalent uh, and very unsure about whether he actually wants to, to run for office again. And I think um, talking for hours and hours to somebody like me was one way of finding out how, how the answers felt to these very strange questions that one has to ask. Uh, and I also think that he wanted to see what the reaction is to this big piece that's now, you know, about to be published. Um, uh, and I think that's what he's going to be basing the decision uh, to run on. In other words, he's watching you and me right now, and he's <laughs> deciding whether or not he should run based on how snarky and obnoxious my interview with you is. Well, I, you know, it's, I, I have to tell you, I was the, the most surprising thing about interviewing him was that all, of all the uh, difficult and uh, sort of embarrassing questions that I had to ask, the easiest ones would seem to be, you know, do you want to run for office? Do you want to run for mayor? How will you decide whether you're going to run for office? And those were the ones that were the most difficult for him to answer, where the pauses were the most uncomfortably long. So um, I really, he's like the very essence to me of, of, of ambivalence about whether, whether he wants to get back into politics or not. So I think... Um, you know, I think, I think he's trying to figure it out. At one point in the interview, he says something really interesting. He says, quote, I want to ask people to give me a second chance. I do want to have that conversation with people whom I let down and with people who put their faith in me and who wanted to support me. I think to some degree, I do want to say to them, give me another chance. How much of this is about, and it's difficult to, to judge this, I guess, for a, a, somebody who is a public servant, a, a politician, but how much of this is about politics and how much of this is about redemption you know it's, it's a very good question I, I i i think that a big part of him wants to kind of cleanse himself of this scandal uh in in in, in more ways than one uh politically speaking you know some people think that he may very well be running for mayor a race that he probably can't win to do that very thing to cleanse himself of the scandal to be able to move on to run for another office and be able to say, we've discussed this, we've moved on. But on the other hand, you know, personally, um, it's hard for me to imagine that he wants this to be the last part, the last note of his public life. So, um, I, you know, I, I think it's clearly part of what's happening here. Some redemption is definitely part of the formula for what's happening.